Scientists working on the Gulf of Mexico oil spill say they found large oil plumes from just beneath the surface of the sea to more than 4,000 feet deep. They've detected three or four large plumes, at least one that is 10 miles long and a mile wide. Researchers say the plumes were perhaps due to the deep injection of dispersants. On Friday, federal regulators approved the underwater use of the chemicals, which act like a detergent to break up the oil and allow it to disperse more quickly. The EPA decision angered state officials and fishermen. It appears that the application of the subsea dispersant is actually working. The oil in the immediate vicinity of the well and the, uh, the ships and rigs working in the area is diminished from previous observations. At least 210,000 gallons of oil are spewing each day from the remains of the Deepwater Horizon oil rig that sunk more than three weeks ago. That cancer has got to be stopped and so uh, we have been working uh, relentlessly including having assembled uh, the best group of scientists from around the world. An attempt to siphon much of the leaking oil failed Saturday. BP officials are making adjustments to the equipment designed to capture the oil and pump it to the surface. The company is also still considering using a smaller containment dome known as Top Hat, and they're considering a junk shot in which golf balls and rubber would be inserted to try to clog the leak. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.